Good morning, YouTubers. Today I'll show you how to make uh, the best coffee using a pre uh, French press machine. Uh, first of all, uh, I use this kind of coffee. It's an organic, uh, it's an organic coffee. It's called Ruta Maya, 100% organic coffee beans. And uh, I like my coffee uh, for, uh, medium, medium roast. So this is like uh, you get most having like a medium roast coffee and uh, all I do is put them on the grinder and this is the grinder I use for, for making my coffee and then you put it on the course because uh, you're making it with the French press and then close it and then press to grind the coffee and okay when you finish your grinding your coffee uh, you put the coffee on the French press uh, this is my French press put the coffee on the f in, inside the French press and boil you know um, boil some water till it boils and then pour it on the French press um, uh, the water and then use a spoon and stir it but don't don't touch the side just stir in the middle because you don't want to break the glass because uh, uh, you know you're heating it with a spoon um, once you've done that, leave it for five minutes um, for everything to, uh, everything like, you know, just leave it for five minutes to sit so, uh, you know, your water and your coffee can get their flavor and they can mix well. And that's how you get good coffee by letting it sit for five minutes. And uh, I love using this uh, sugar in the roll. Uh, it's a raw, uh, it's raw sugar for, you know, I, I put almost like uh, three spoons of sugar, you know, that's my three spoons of sugar a day for the rest of the day. So, uh, you know, everybody says sugar is bad, but sugar is good too. But it depends how you use it. So if you overuse it, it's, you know, like anything else, like too much of something is, is dangerous. So three, uh, three uh, tablespoons of sugar, because I like my coffee black. And, uh, you know, I, I drink it before I go to the gym because, you know, it pumps the blood and it's good for you uh, when you're working out because uh, your blood is flowing, uh, you know, that's the benefit of coffee. Oh, there is my uh, timer. So, after I've done that, uh, and then you, that's, that's the time you press it down. So when you put this top, don't press it down, just leave it up and then put your coffee, uh, put your coffee and your water and stir it and leave, leave this thing up and time it for five minutes. After five minutes, that's when you press this thing down and uh, there is my cup ready for this magic. And you pour your coffee. Voila, and stir it nicely so the sugar and the coffee can get to know each other and love each other. Mmm, that's a good black coffee made with the French press. I love making my coffee with the French press, it's easy. Uh, and it's clean uh, not like all these machines because you know machines have you know they have their darts and you have to clean them up and it's just too much work for me I'd rather make my coffee with a French press and have a clean beautiful coffee and uh, it's easy to clean the French press and you know you can clean it every day so you, you know you're having a clean coffee coming from a clean container and uh, next time, actually, I have this thing. It's called hydrogen peroxide. It's a rave, but you know, you have to know how to use it. And uh, I, I've been drinking it for the past month. And I'll let you know, guys, how um, why people are doing it and why it's good for you. Otherwise, keep in touch and don't forget to subscribe, press that bell, and I'll be next uh, next time. See you later, YouTubers. Ha, ha, ha.